Excitement enveloping everyone here because it is a huge occasion. The Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned club kings of Europe? It's PSG and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Paris Saint-Germain facing Barcelona. Well, Derek... for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos at the back. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts together with Neymar. This is what we think for Barcelona. Mark and Reiter Stegen starts in goal. Frankie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And leading the line today, Robert Lewandowski. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway. Who will be crowned club kings of Europe? Neymar. Now Busquets. Dembele. What can they do from here? Oh, what an opportunity! Well, just watch this again. Lewandowski's pass is inch perfect. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1-0. Minch, Neymar, can he get them level, oh terrific save, well you're absolutely right, that's a top class save, just look how he reacts, fired in by Neymar, oh super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task, Kunde onto De Jong, not giving him a moment's peace. Lewandowski and space to exploit, maybe. De Jong 
He might be onto something. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. But I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. So 2 0 now. Renato Sanchez. And a fine tackle. And now having a go. And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Mbappe. Moving forward effectively. Sanchez, a chance to eat into the lead. And it's in! This game very much back on as a contest. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Well, the ball is moving again. The push is on from Paris Saint-Germain. Can they come up with an equaliser? Pedri. It's with Marcos Alonso. Lewandowski. Lewandowski. Real chance. And searching for his second, but the keeper equal to the task. Well, he's looking really lively, isn't he? Every time he gets the ball, he looks a threat. And the corner played over by Dembele. Well, in fairness, it wasn't the best of headers. Marco Verratti. Nuno Mensch. Mbappe with it. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Mbappe. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Verratti. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Verratti. And blocked for now. Well, as you see, Barcelona haven't had too much of the ball. But that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. Oh, sure, they must score! Not problematic for the keeper. Kimpembe. Neymar. That's useful play, but quick thinking defensively. Marcos Alonso. Lewandowski now. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Lewandowski. Crossing possibilities. 
Not a classic example of how to intercept. Verratti. Well, getting close to half time and Barcelona with the advantage. Stuart, what have you made of the performance? Well, it's been a good first half so far and they've been the better side, certainly going forward. They now just need to keep playing with intensity right up to the break. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Alonso. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Araujo and the ball with Christensen De Jong Rafinha throw in here for Barcelona Pedri Lewandowski wonderful chance well decent save there <laughs> And the substitution will occur now. <laughs> Playing it in. And a goal! To increase the lead in this final! Will they be stopped now? Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Neymar. Mbappe. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Attacking possibilities for PSG. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Oh, he's through here. And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. So the corner played into the box. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. And the short option preferred. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Well, PSG have controlled most of the possession, as you can see. But they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. Well, perhaps they can do something better with the ball now. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free-kick situation? Substitution time it is here. Oh, what an exquisite goal! Absolute perfection! Well, what can you say?
say about this. It's hit so cleanly with exactly the right amount of bend on it. And he does so well to get it back down in time once it goes over the wall. Excellent strike. Well, the action underway once more. And no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. Frankie de Jong. We're getting the ball forward. Now he must favour the cross. Who's going to win this joust? Read it well. Lewandowski. Could be a chance to break here. Beautifully disguised ball. And the referee has pointed to the spot. He's given the penalty. And now, let's see if they can level it up. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. Can they make it three apiece? minutes to go good looking sequence will he play it in but it stopped a promising attack in its tracks and you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here well he's gone into the book well he was late and he deserved a booking for that well no real accuracy and easy for the keeper Pablo Sarabia. Verratti. Neymar. And on the ball, Sarabia. Mbappe. Verratti. Back to Mbappe. Getting through fantastic work here just to keep possession. Pedri. De Jong. Oh, he's given the ball away. Kessier. Rafinha. Barcelona on the attack in the closing moments. Still level here. Dembele. And the keeper getting across to stop it. The corner to Barca with the minute sticking away. And deciding to go short with this one. Robert Lewandowski in the middle. Not all that convincing defensively. Tempele. Well, he's given it away. Well, he prevented it from going over the line. Kessier. De Jong, superb block. Get 
Kimpembe. And he read it well. And still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture. Just narrowly off target. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Fabian. Barassi now. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Barassi. Lionel Messi. On to Mbappe. And a strong tackle. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. back in business here the first period of extra time and it might well come down to mental fortitude who wants this more useful looking ball take pair of hands did his job Soler and on the ball Sarabia Lionel Messi. Can he put them in front? Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Fati. Cut out by Kim Bembe. Mbappe. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. SCA and intercepts again. And the emphasis is on creativity. Sarabia. Soler. Still looking for space. Oh, a fine block. it again and no wonder the manager is furious they just have to get tighter here deal with the danger otherwise that's the outcome not good enough defensively side shy about shooting in this match Depay promising sequence oh a vital interception well the attack will peter out keeper's ball The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. And Neymar! A terrific pass. Still looking to get the shot off. A really top-notch piece of defending. Well, that's it for the first period of extra time. Let's see what the second has in store.
Well, extra time continues. We're into the second period now. Who can he pick out? But strong defending. Committed challenge. Out of play then. Barcelona throw coming up. This could be the equaliser. But oh, what an important save. How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. And played short. De Jong. And reading it absolutely superbly. Barcelona fighting against this overall situation. What can they pull out of the fire? Good visualisation and execution. And nearly the ideal ball, but a good piece of defending. Soler Mbappe and the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG well no card but I think he can consider himself suitably warned very alert defending to put a stop to the chance breaking at pace Depay, chances on, and a goal here, the keeper unable to prevent it, Barcelona are level. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and that's a great finish from Depay. 1v1 against the keeper, he never looked like missing. That's a top-class finish. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Sarabia, determined defending. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. After 120 minutes, they cannot be separated. And so, in this Champions League final, it comes down to a shootout. And so the penalty shootout about to commence. And as a player, this is when you have to hold your nerve. Well, he stuttered a bit, but the goal has been given. Can he remain calm? And there it is, perfectly executed. And he succeeds in finding the bottom corner. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. Oh, he saved it! And he's taken the low road, beautifully done. And he steps up to take his penalty. And it's gone in. And he scores. You want a pressure cooker, this is it. He must score. And the penalty converted here. It all falls on his shoulders. If he scores, they win. He's gambled on direction and won.
and confidently converted. Mental preparation is such a big part of this. And slotted home right into the bottom corner. Excellent penalty. So lethal in front of goal. Can he get the better of the keeper? Job done from the spot. Oh, that's it! The final act in the drama. One team jubilant, the other distraught. Well, what an end into a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment for everyone involved with the club, but for their opponents, it's a case of trying to forget and move on as quickly as possible. Well, I think we should give them some credit too. They played their part in what was an excellent contest. Some of their football was brilliant. Yes, fair play, Stuart. The party in full swing now. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Paris Saint-Germain. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy.